In this video, I am going to explain you about a Google Play console error related to Play app signing. This error I have received while updating my published Android app with Android app bundle file. So let's see what is causing this error and how to solve it. Hello friends, welcome back to Ireka Tech Solutions. I have an app which is already published to the Google Play Store and the uploaded file type is APK. Now I have an update to the app. So I have created AAB file and trying to update. For this, first I release in closed testing and after testing the build I will move it to production. Because if we get any crashes or ex exceptions, we can find out in closed testing and also in play console we can get pre-launch report. So we can fix them all before releasing to production. So you can also follow this best practice. So drop the AAB file, this error I am receiving. It says to upload an Android app bundle, you must be enrolled in play app signing. When you go up, there is a message related to app integrity. Google is not protecting the app signing key for your app. Opt in to use Android app bundles. And here there is an option to opt in. But first of all, what is play app signing? We are already signing the build in Android Studio before uploading to Play Console. Then what is this Google app signing? What is the purpose of this app signing process? For this, the clear explanation is given in the developer site. With Play app signing, Google manages and protects your app signing key for you and uses it to sign your APKs for distribution. Play app signing uses two keys. Those are the app signing key and the upload key. Upload key is nothing but what we create in our Android studio using create new option and use it to sign the app build file before publishing on play store. Upload key is with the app developer always. And the app signing key is what we export the encrypted key from Android studio by selecting the export checkbox. Here whatever the path we specify the encrypted key is exported to the specified path which is nothing but app signing key which we are going to share for Google Play app signing in Play Console. So the app signing key is in .pepk extension. When you upload this key for app signing Google uses this key to verify your identity and signs your APKs with your app signing key before distributing to end users devices. The difference is for apps created before August 2021 that have not opted into play app signing, if you lose your app signing key, you lose the ability to update your app because key store does not match. But now as we are sharing our upload key as app signing key by play app signing, even we lost our upload key, by using a separate upload key, you can request an upload key reset to Google. Okay, let's go to play console and configure play app signing. For this, go to setup app integrity and select app signing. Here you can see two options. First one is use existing app signing key from Android Studio. As I explained earlier in Android Studio by selecting export encrypted key checkbox, we can get the private key in the specified path. The same key we can upload it here. The second option is use existing app signing key from Java key store. This option you can select when you are using a different IDE other than Android Studio for your app development. In that case, you have to download this tool and run the commands in the terminal. Whatever the encrypted key you get it as output, you have to upload it here. And there are some more uh, advanced options are there. Use existing app signing key from another repository. That means if you are creating a different app signing key using your own tools, that key also you can upload it. But this time you should be very careful to store this key more securely. Because if you lost this, you cannot update your apps in Play Store. And the last option is use a new app signing key. This involves using the same app signing key as another app in this developer account. So mostly this is not recommended. So I am skipping this. Now go back to first option, select upload private key. So the key, whatever we exported from Android studio, select the key and save changes. So the signing key is uploaded. Your current app signing keys encryption strength meets or exceeds Google place recommended minimum standard. 
Okay, now let's upload the Android app bundle file. Go to close testing, edit release. See here, release is signed by Google Play. So now try to upload bundle file. Okay, it's uh, loading. See the file is uploaded successfully. Review release and roll out to close testing. So once testing is done and there are no issues with the app, then from here only I will directly promote it to production. Hope my explanation was clear enough on play app signing. If you could solve this error using this video, please like, comment and subscribe to iRaka Tech Solutions. Thank you.